The reception of Helldivers 2 in context. Helldivers 2 is a game about going to war with bugs and automatons so far. Helldivers 2 is a live service game done right, having come out when other games like it want you to grind and are pushing too hard for your money, Helldivers 2 respects your time and your wallet. It contains microtransactions but gives you the ability to earn the paid currency at a decent speed and doesn't require you to play 10 hours a day just to progress. Game puts us all on the same team and makes sure you know that every little bit counts, especially since the liberation values trickle in a single drop at a time, even just one mission is enough. For missions, combat and visuals are spectacular and exciting, weapons all feel weighty and strong, and reticle indicators clearly show when you aren't making a single dent. Having a great level of control of your character feels like you're right there in the battle, and missions are designed to be completed within 40 minutes, often doable in less than 20 minutes, which is a perfect chunk of gameplay if you only have a little while to play. On rare occasion, that flow can be interrupted by jarring bugs or sudden crashes, and the first weekend after release was a waiting game. Because the game blew up in popularity immediately, so much so that a 500,000 player cap on the servers was not nearly enough space for everyone wanting to join in. The public opinion of the game is very good, with most players saying that it's a bit rough around the edges, but that the foundation, the world building, and the style of the game are so stellar that we're all excited to see where Super Earth's liberation efforts can take us.